Hi everyone, this is Cream Bun, and welcome to my first ever Storytime Speed Paint. So, let's begin! October 18th was a very important day. It was my puppy's birthday! His name is Feluda. If you haven't watched any of my other videos, then you probably wouldn't know that. But you can just call him Felu, because Feluda is a pretty long name. So Feluda is a Patterdale Terrier, and we adopted him last year during Thanksgiving break, and we found out his birthday was sometime in October. We weren't sure exactly what time, so we just chose a random weekend where some of his puppy friends were free to come over and have a little party. So for his friends, we couldn't invite more than two puppies because it would be a lot to handle three dogs all together. And no matter how much we love them, we, wouldn't, we want to give them all special care. So we only invited two other of his friends, even though he makes a lot of friends. He's really good at that and because he's a real prodigy. So we invited his girlfriend, Akira, and she is a husky Australian Shepherd mix, I think, and some other mix. I'm not exactly sure exactly what breed she is, but she is adorable as well. And she and Felula, as I have said before, are girlfriend and boyfriend, or we like to pretend, because they really love each other and they're really good friends. And they never hurt each other. They only play wrestle and they have a lot of fun. Now, the other puppy we invited, he is eight months old, and but he is the biggest. He is a big baby, and his name is Griffy. He and Feluda are like brother and little brother, big brother and little brother, and they really, really love each other. They play a lot and have a lot of fun together. They play fight, and they're just like goofing off like siblings all the time. So we invited him too. So... As soon as everybody got there, and Griffy actually stayed for a sleepover the night before. Griffy is the puppy who was eight months old, if I didn't say that. Uh, I didn't write a script for this. And Akira is the one on the right. I am drawing her right now. And anyways, the first thing we wanted to do after everyone got there and goofed around for some time is we went to Kemp Park, which is basically an open grass field where they can all play. As soon as we arrived there, we also brought some other things that we had packed the day before we had bought from the Dollar Tree, and those things were little headbands that you could put on humans, but when you put them on puppies, they actually look sort of like costumes because we put them on their backs. So I will be drawing those later on on the dogs in this video, but basically Feludas was like a yellow band with two stars or crowns or something sticking out of it, which each said happy birthday. Akira's was basically a mermaid tail and a blue starfish or gems or something and like a little pink wrap coming out of that. And then Griffey's, he had a green headband which we put on his back and it had two lines sticking out of it which connected to a little drawing of lemonade and another one of coconut and a straw coming out of it. So sort of like a tropical one for Griffey. We put them on them and they all loved them and th we took a lot of photos. It was really sweet. I actually have a photo that um, looks a lot like the one I'm drawing right now. It is not a reference photo. I'm not using any reference. So again, forgive me if I get some of it wrong, but I thought it looked sort of like the one I'm drawing after I finished my drawing. So I'll show you that one later too in the video. Anyways, at Kemp Park, they all goofed around, played, got into some mischief when they jumped into the tall grass. They had a lot of fun there, just playing and goofing off like little goofballs, and Felula really enjoyed himself. Then they all relaxed in the cool grass, and we took a photo shoot. I actually wore like a flower dress because it was um, my puppy's birthday, and he's sort of my, my, my little brother. So it was my brother's birthday, and then it was a lot of fun. And we decided after a while that it was time to go back from Kemp Park. As soon as we got back from Kemp Park, we got back home and we decided since they had a lot of exercise, they could just, by we I mean my family and I, we decided they could have some rest. So they had some rest, they cooled down, and they played with each other for a little while again after that. And after they were playing, after they were done playing and relaxing, we thought it's time for birthday cake. So we baked a fresh pup cake on the day. A pup cake is basically like a puppy cake that we made up the recipe for. And it actually looks more like a pup pancake now that I think of it, like after we baked it. But they all loved it. So what we put in the pup cake slash pancake is um, we basically baked it with some sort of flour. I don't remember what type to hold it together. Um, some sort of puppy safe flour, uh, flour. I don't remember exactly. And we also added some fish, some ground beef, some dog treats, 
um, some cheese and some ground carrots. And we frosted it with peanut butter. And we baked it. It actually, like, baked really well. I was surprised. I thought it would just be, like, batter. But it baked really well. And it came out. And it even smelled good, unlike other dog food. And I don't know what that says about me. But it just smelled good, okay? And then when we took it out of the oven, we let it cool down for some time. And after frosting it with peanut butter, again... And so the peanut butter and the peanut butter melted on top of the cake. We added two little bones on top of it, and the bones had holes in them. And inside of them, we put candles, two candles, because he's turning two. Yeah. So we put those two bones with the two candles inside of them, and um, put it on the table. And we lifted Felu on the table too. Akira and Griffy sat in the ch- sat down on the floor on the other sides of the table, and we saying happy birthday, and I blew out the candles from behind Feluda's back while my parents took a video, so it looked like Feluda blew them out. It was really sweet. Feluda and the others loved the cake, which is surprising because Feluda has a very picky appetite. Feluda, he enjoyed slurping it down, and he ate it really well. Griffy practically inhaled it and almost ate my hand with the cake when I served it to him. And then Akira, she really loved the cake and she ate it in a ladylike manner because, of course, she is a lady. So then anyways, she ate it. She really liked it. That was just a joke. She really liked it. Everyone liked it. They enjoyed the cake. And I was surprised because I was like almost 99% sure that Feluda wouldn't like the cake because he's extremely picky. But surprisingly, Feluda actually loved it the most, I think, out of everybody. And they all enjoyed it. After eating, they all rested for a while and Feluda slept on the bed on a fuzzy blanket. And the others slept on, and Akira slept on the bed as well with me and Felu. And then Griffy slept on a like fluffy blanket that was next to the bed on the floor. And they relaxed. They had, they were relaxing and sleeping, and then we also put the costumes back on while they were relaxing and took a couple photos there. It was so cute. They were all standing next to each other on the bed. It was adorable, and we just let them relax for a while because they had had a long, tiring day already. They played at the park, ate a whole bunch of cake, and then they goofed around again in between, so we decided to give them some rest, and they were all enjoying the day because puppies love exercise. Like, exercise is one of their favorite things to do. Lastly but not leastly, we all went to the dog park at the end of the day where Felula and Akira are regulars, so they met all their friends there, and Griffy has been there for the second time, so he made a lot of new friends. He was a bit shy because he's a puppy and very young, but he made a lot of friends. Oh, also Akira is three years old. I think I forgot to say that. They all had a wonderful time at the dog park, meeting and wrestling with their other friends, and then we took them back home. When we took them back, they drank water, and after they drank, and then we ate, we served uh, Kira and Griffy dinner. There's a reason we didn't serve Felula dinner yet, which you will see later, which I will say. We served Akira and Griffy dinner. Gr- Akira had to go, wait, no, Griffy had to go, and then later in the day, Akira had to go as well. At the end of the day, oh, in the picture, I think I'm drawing the cake now, right now. So, uh, yeah, I'm trying my best to draw the cake that they had. It might be a bit off. But anyways, for dinner that day, Feluda had what he's probably had as the best dinner ever. He didn't have any of his nutrition granules, which he usually hates to have, but we make him because they're nutritious. He actually had a big bone with steak and meat attached to it, nicely warmed and smoked, and he loved it. He ate the whole thing and enjoyed it a whole bunch, and I think it was a wonderful birthday party. So thank you all for watching this video, and I hope you enjoyed it. I certainly did enjoy making this, and I really hope to do more of these little story times. I love to tell you all little stories about my life and my puppy's life, and my lunch break's almost over, so I gotta get back to school. Toodles! 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 Toodles!